The works that touch me the most are the ones that deal with identity, with emotion, with the self. My name is Maria Sukar. I founded the I Self Collection with my husband Malik over 10 years ago. We call the collection I Self because it has identity at its core. It examines all the themes that revolves around identity, like sex, birth, death, love. Most of the artists represented are women, and the collection includes many Middle Eastern artists. If you do not understand what the self is, how will you be able to connect with the other and express yourself and understand the other? My name's Emily Butler. I'm the Mahira and Mohammed Abu Ghezala curator at the Whitechapel Gallery, and I'm the curator of this exhibition, which is called Bumped Bodies. It looks at the relationship between the body, the object and the environment. This exhibition is titled Bunt Body after a work by Paloma Varga Weiss. By titling it Bunt Body, we're questioning notions of self and selfhood, looking at the limits of the body and the object. The sculpture shows an ambiguously gendered figure hanging from the gallery wall. Not quite sure if they're male or female, what age they are, and they're encased in this gleaming copper shell. The work is reflecting on this unique moment in your life in pregnancy. As I know very well, it's this unique moment where you become very aware of your physicality. You become almost like a vessel for this new life. So it's essentially a work that's really making us reflect on notions of self and selfhood. There's works by 23 major international artists in this display. Certain artists are using deconstructed representations of the human body. The body might be sliced in half, like with Alexander Birkin. The body might be reproduced several times, like The Five Nudes by John Stesica. Artists are also showing bodies in relation to objects, bodies that are burrowing into an object. Artists are also making us reconsider our relationship with the biological world, our relationship with animals, with wild shorky, for example, or with natural materials such as a stick in the disconcerting work by Bojan Sasevic. We are in constant exchange and interaction with our environment and we keep on using whatever we see around us, whether it's wood or concrete, wax or fabric, to create new works that represent us. This is the fourth and final display drawn from the iSelf collection. I hope that the audience have really enjoyed this in-depth artistic investigation into the concept of the self. In this moment when a lot of our identity is being formed online, a lot of questions about identity are circulating on social media, a lot of the artists in the display are making us rethink about our body and our identity in the physical world.